Hey Dynamos, we're going to be telling time today to the half hour, so I want to give you a couple of reminders. When the tall minute hand is on the 12, we say o'clock, and when the tall minute hand is on the 6, we say 30. Today we're going to practice times that say 30, because the big hand is going to be on the 6 every time. Okay, so here's your first time. All right, if I look at my hour hand, it's in the yellow section. The yellow section is two o'clock. So it is 2.30. If you wrote 2.30, you can have one point. Let's try this time. hand is in the blue section which means it's five and the minute hand is on the six which means we say 30 so if you wrote 5 30 you can have a point nice job let's try this time The hour hand is in the teal or the turquoise, which means it's eight. And the minute hand is on the six, which means we say 30. So this is eight, 30. If you got eight, 30, you can have one point. Nice job. This is a time I confuse a lot of people with. Let's see if you can do this time. My hour hand is in the red, which means it's still 12. My minute hand is on the 6, which means it's 30. It is 1230. If you got 1230, you can have one point. Nice job. How about this time? My hour hand is in the purple, which means it's still one. My minute hand is on the six, which means it's 30. It is 130. If you wrote 130, you can have one point. Good job. Let's try this time. My hour hand is in the green, which means that it's still three. My minute hand is on the six, which means that it's 30. It is 3.30. If you got 3.30, you can have a point. Nice job. Lots of people confused this time too. I'm gonna see if I can trick somebody. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? The hour 
hand is in the brown, the brown means it's 6, and the minute hand is on the 6, which means 30, so this time is 630. If you got 630, you can give yourself a point. Hey, how are you doing? All right, this is Miss Strass's bedtime. See if you can figure out what time Miss Strass goes to bed. My hour hand is in the orange, which means it's nine. My minute hand is on the six, which means it's nine. 30. You got 930. You can give yourself a point. All right. This is my last one. My last hard one I can think of. See if you can figure out what time it is. The hour hand is in the blue, which means it's 11. The minute hand is on the 6, which means it's 30. So it is 11.30. If you got 11.30, you can give yourself a point. How many points did you get? All right, you're gonna need to look in your packet for this paper. It's called Telling Time to the Half Hour. It has two sides. Okay, I threw in a couple of tricky clocks that aren't really half hour times like this one, so be careful and don't get tricked. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to look at the clock and then you need to make that time on your clock so you can use the colors to help you because there's no colors on this clock and it looks different. So I made my hour hand right between my one and my two. So it's exactly the same. And I put my minute hand on the six, and now I'm gonna look at it and see what time it is. It's in the purple, so it's still one, and it's pointing to the six, so it's 1.30, and I wrote 1.30 right under the clock, okay? Do each clock time on your clock to make sure you read the hours right, okay? See you guys later.